Hey guys, what's going on everybody? It's your host Omar Alatar here, creator of the Passionate Few Podcast, and today I'm going to be going over the top six questions that I've gotten about my coaching programs, working one-on-one with people around the world, and it's something that I'm really passionate about with my coaching program. You know, we took it off the market for a while, and while I only work with a handful of people at a time, uh, it's something that bring, brought me tremendous joy, and I've worked with people all over the world from all walks of life. So. Uh, if you stay tuned till the end of this video, you'll learn a little bit more about my coaching program. You'll also learn about some of the questions a lot of people have, some of the limitations people have, and also hear some of the success stories of people I've worked with. So if you've ever been curious about my coaching program or working with me one-on-one to blow up your brand, grow your podcast, grow your YouTube show, and uh, really want to make sure that the size of your brand is congruent with the size of your business and your mission, I think you'll want to stay tuned to the very end. And also, if you want to apply to work with me, you can check out the description below uh, to apply there. And uh, with no further ado, let's get right into the video of the top six questions that people ask me about working with me one-on-one as their coach to blow up their brand. Who have you worked with and or what is your credibility? Great question. So my experience and credibility is twofold. Number one, I've worked with people who literally from experts in Australia to newbies in Southern California people across the country to people who want to do you know virtual interviews right whether it's in person or virtual i've had experience helping people build platforms i know i have a copywriter for example i have a sales guy out in southern california who just interviewed dean graziosi actually got the first copy of uh, dean's brand new book i've worked with people in the midwest and really my passion is helping people get connected to people they never thought would be possible and doing it in a way where not only are they building a relationship, but they're actually building value to an audience. So those are some of the people I've worked with across the country. In terms of my personal credibility, I went from three years ago being totally broke, lost, depressed to building a multiple six-figure business, scaling upwards, um, literally starting from literally just interviewing people. Literally, when I interviewed Grant Cardone, um, Tom Billy, the billion dollar creator of Quest Nutrition, I was too broke to afford gas to go to the interviews. So I went through the trenches, and so I kind of did it in reverse. A lot of people, what they do is they build a big business, and then they go out and build a personal brand. And one thing I realized is that personal branding is all about being at the beginning of a trend. And I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen the power and the trend of podcasting. I've got students from all over the world who checked out my High Ticket Podcast Accelerator, which you guys can check out in the description below. It's 500 bucks, you guys can check it out. Uh, at this time, it should be 500 bucks. But basically, I help people go from where I was when I started being literally clueless about how to get in touch with people, to how to build an audience, how to build a network, how to build a team, how to create content, and how to monetize that content. So my credibility comes from doing it myself. And the challenge is that I couldn't not be credible even if I tried, because I have an audience of people, almost 100,000 subscribers at the time of watching this uh, on YouTube alone, let alone the podcast platforms of Spotify, uh, Apple Podcasts, Libsyn, all the other applications. But basically, my credibility comes from my experience and my body of work of sitting down with, at this stage, a few dozen, over 50 multi-million and multi-billion dollar entrepreneurs across industry in person. So it's way more challenging in person than virtual, and I teach this inside of my course, although both are possible. But uh, I've gotten tons of no's and quite a few yeses, and so I bridge the gap so I condense the time between how long it takes people to go from an idea in their head to living their dreams in reality and having an audience uh, enjoy it in the process because I've done it first. I've been through the trenches, I got beaten up, and now I help people not get beat up and uh, not go through the trenches so that they can get on top uh, in their brand online as well. All right, what is your coaching program about? All right, guys, so what is my coaching program all about to begin with? Well, basically, it works step by step depending on where you're at. So I tend to work with entrepreneurs who are at the six-figure level looking to scale upwards and making sure their personal brand is congruent with the size of their business, the size of their mission, and the size of their impact. So my coaching is really designed to help you step by step build your own show, whether it's just a podcast on an audio platform, although I highly recommend to my clients to do it on YouTube, but how they can bridge the two and create multi-dimensional content so they can repurpose it a million different ways and leverage it through the platform of interviews. My expertise is really allowing people to collaborate high net worth individuals, high impact individuals across various niches and bringing them together. That way, say you're a client of mine, 
online and you have a show and you want to reach more people with your products, your services, your mission, your vision, well guess what? If you want to know what works, you study what's already working. And what's already proven to work is inheriting the audience of people who already have a loyal audience within a niche. So what I basically in English help people do is I help people create their own powerful personal brand that creates more congruence, more impact, that's aligned with where they're at in their business and how they're trying to get to the next level. And I do it through helping people create value-based interviews with high net worth people that already have leverage so that you can help position yourself as an expert in your niche. Uh, what different industries would this work for? All right, great question. What industry does this work in? Well, this is for thought leaders, experts, authors, coaches, consultants, people looking to have more impact and scale their business, and they realize the power of social media as audiences grow across many platforms. And this is also for people who want to take advantage of those platforms across industries. The reality today is that if you're selling products or services and you're only selling physical and not online, you're missing out on a huge market. And if you're selling them online and you're not reaching audiences based on the power of free value-based content through interviews, which allows you to get people's time, they normally charge upwards of 10 to 50, you know, at this stage, over hundreds of thousands of dollars that I've gotten to spend the fortune of time with, multi-millionaires, multi-billion dollar entrepreneurs build my network. Well, I help people access my network and instantly allow it to be a part of theirs so they can have more impact with their business, their mission, and what it is they're looking to grow by growing an audience. What makes your coaching program different than other in the marketplace? Great question. So what makes my coaching program different is that I give a lot more than I've seen a lot of coaches give. And I'm not bashing on coaches. I have coaches to this day. But for me, one-on-one -on -one coaching is something that I enjoy tremendously because I get to work from people, I get to work with people from all walks of life, all sorts of industries. And I literally help them, whether they're clueless and they want to start, or maybe they're intermediate level, they're already in the midst of uh, taking action, building their show, but they're kind of getting hung up on how to get big guests, how to build a team, how to do it cost effectively, right? How to sort of iron out the kinks. And one cool thing about my program, and you guys can check out in the description below, I have an explainer video about both my $15,000 and $25,000 uh, upper level mastermind coaching programs. But basically what I help people do over the course of three to six months, depending on how we space it out, is not only do you get 12 one-on-one -on -one calls with me, for one hour each where it's one-on-one -on -one with myself. You can ask me anything. I'll help give you value in any area you're stuck and wanna uh, accelerate in. But I also give you 24 seven access to my personal line. That means that you have 24 seven access to me over text or voice memo. If you have any questions, if you want access to my team, you have 100% curtains pulled back to access uh, to me and my team. And the coolest part is that they have experience across spectrum. So whether it's video, audio, ads, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, uh, you name it, myself and my team can serve you at the highest level through it. And I only take on a few people at a time. So what makes people different is that there are very few people in our, in our niche, uh, particularly on YouTube, who built what I built. And I say it not to impress you, but to impress upon you that we've really gone above and beyond to credit in ourselves and our business. And we go above and beyond for our coaching clients as well. And again, guys, if you want more information or you want to apply, uh, for my coaching program, you can check out the description below to get more information. Watch that video. I explain on a whiteboard exactly what my $15,000 coaching program comes with and what my $25,000 coaching program comes with. And that one is a done for you where I actually book the guests for you. And I'll actually help you create content. Literally, I hold your hand through the steps. That way you can have maximum impact with minimum overwhelm. So uh, that's kind of what makes my program different. It's also what makes it exciting and also it's also what makes it scary because the reality is I want to make sure that I only work with A-level people that are a good fit. You know, there's a lot of people. This program is definitely not for you if you're a dabbler. This program is really for you only if you're committed to being a master. And you see podcasting and you see content as one of the most powerful ways to grow your audience in this day and age because let's face it, nowadays, what better way is there to get in rooms with people or on Skype calls or in connection with people and build value for them for free than by starting a podcast, starting your own show, uh, and let alone doing it at the highest level. I mean, think about what that does for your brand. And then think about this. Now I'm getting excited here. Uh, but think about what happens if you don't, right? Think about what happens if audiences grow and grow on other platforms, if they grow and grow for other people, but they don't grow for you. What happens to your business? What happens to your income? What happens to your personal brand? What happens to your products, your services, your sales, your impact? All that diminishes. So. The, the, the ship is sailing, the only question is if you wanna jump aboard, and what I help people do is not only jump aboard, uh, but actually sit in the cockpit with the pilots and uh, have access that they never thought would be possible. So that's one cool thing that I do, is I actually am in the trenches, done for you, and uh, yeah, it's been a very fulfilling journey for me and my clients, and um, I'm very grateful that I, that I get to do what I love with people uh, who also love what they do. What if I don't feel like I'm good on camera? 
Ooh, this is a great question. A lot of people are camera shy or think they're camera shy or, uh, you know, I get a lot of people say, well, you know, my voice isn't that good or, you know, would I even be entertaining? Am I even good at carrying a conversation? And actually, one of the epiphanies I had, and I teach this with my coaching clients as well as in my course, is that a lot of people think that it's a lot more anxiety ridden than it actually is. It's kind of like going on a first date. You know, sometimes you might be a little nervous, but then you go and you're like, oh, this isn't bad. Or maybe you hear yourself on a phone call. And you're like, man, that's my voice, right? You get a little bit of anxiety and nerves. You get a little bit of anxiousness going. Well, one of the coolest things is that I've actually been there. And I'm teaching from experience because I sat in chairs and rooms I didn't even belong in. I mean, I remember at one point, I sat down with Grant Cardone and Ed Milet with seven cameras around us and about 20 multi-million dollar multi-family real estate investors watching. So believe me, when it comes to nerves, I've been to the Hell Mountain and back. And I gotta tell you, I help my coaching clients realize one of the most powerful things about creating your own interview show is that the pressure is not on you. One of the most beautiful things you realize when you start your own show or podcast or YouTube show or platform as you grow is that a lot of the burden is on them. And so all you have to do is facilitate excellent conversation, excellent dialogue. And if you have a framework for asking questions, the same way I introduced it in my course, if you have a framework or outline for what you want your interview to be like, you'll actually find that it's a lot easier than you think and that you, yes, you uh, can do it. And again, this is only for people who are serious or see themselves you know, doing it for the long haul, not just for a day or two or a week or two or a month or two or a year or two, but people who could see themselves doing this for a couple years, really building impact uh, and realizing that at the end of the day, it's selfish to get anxiety, it's selfish to get nervous, especially when you're trying to serve an audience. So that's one of the coolest parts uh, about building a show and helping people get over their, their beliefs about courage is that not only is the mindset something I help you with and actually iron out the kinks to get through, but the second thing is that it's not as uh, nerve wracking as you actually think it is. It's a lot easier than you think and a lot of the pressure, the burden is on them to answer the questions. You just have to facilitate dialogue. Plus. Uh, whether you're doing it virtually or in person, you have a lot of control of editing uh, and post-production. So it's a lot easier uh, than you think, and I help people uh, demonstrate that instead of just say it. So that's one cool part about it, is that you have a lot more power in you than you think. Oh, and the last thing I want to say is that everybody's podcast that you listen to had that exact same thought at first. So remember that. You're totally okay for feeling that way. They felt it too, but the only way to it is through it, and I help uh, put my coaching clients and my course clients uh, do exactly that. What are some of your success stories and testimonials from people you have helped? Oh man, dude, I love that question. Well, I'll tell you what, to be honest with you, instead of me telling you what I've done for clients all over the world from you know entrepreneurs locally to multi-million dollar entrepreneurs to nine-figure, hundred million dollar entrepreneurs, I've helped people across the board launch their show, grow more impact, and really maximize their authority and positioning online. Uh, through social media, branding, podcasting, YouTubing. But I'll tell you what, instead of me saying it, uh, why don't we roll some testimony so you can say what people have to say about working with me in my coaching program. What's up everybody, I'm Tom Bilyeu and I'm here to say that if you're trying to learn how to do a podcast, this man, Omar, is an extraordinary interviewer. I think his podcast is phenomenal. There is a reason that we've done two interviews with him now. I really, really think he's great. And he's the name that I actually hear more than anybody else out there from other guests who've been on his show that are like, damn, that guy is a good interviewer. So I totally agree. I think he's amazing. And I think that he has a lot to offer. Hi Omar, I just want to take the time to say thank you so much for helping me achieve all of the things that I've achieved this year. At the start of the year I felt quite broken and I had no idea what I was getting myself into. All I knew was that I was desperate for change and I had this crazy idea of wanting to set up my own podcast, get into speaking and also coaching and you managed to help me achieve all of those things and more. So with my podcast, without your encouragement, I would not have been able to have Sarah Centrella on as my second guest on my podcast. And without your encouragement, I would not have created the content that I'm creating today, which has helped me achieve over a million views on LinkedIn and grow my network to just under 20,000 in under six months. Thank you so much for believing in me and I will be forever grateful for your presence in my life. Hi, this is Dan Locke. I'm the king of high ticket sales. Now, if you ever get a chance to work with Omar, I've worked with his team. We just did an interview together. He is a very, very professional guy. Now, there are a lot of people out there who offers coaching programs or different types of programs. And quite frankly, a lot of them are shit, right? So if you ever get a chance, spend your money wisely. Spend it with Omar. I think you won't be disappointed. All right, so th there's like a simple formula. 
right, to get what you want. And that is to find somebody who's got the thing you want, see what it is they're doing, and then do more of that. The challenge comes where we're always gonna inevitably have questions like, well, how did you do that? Why did you do that? And what do you say? And the best way to get those questions answered is to find the person and directly ask them and get them to help you. And that's what Omar can do for you. He can help you go from not having a podcast and no guests and nobody knows you to having a noteworthy, recognizable guest in a very short amount of time, not because he makes these big promises, because that's exactly what he did. His third guest ever was a multi-billion dollar entrepreneur, you know, out of nowhere. And he's done it over and over again with all these business celebrities constantly getting these unobtainable people on the show. So if you want to be able to have a podcast that's successful and get extremely popular guests on your show to help you build your own brand name, makes a lot of sense to let Omar help you do that because he can. And more importantly, he's probably one of the only people in the space that's really willing to take the time with you to sit down and help you through the process step by step. So I'd recommend you link up with him and I'd recommend you do it fast. That was a, that guy, that was a pretty good interview. It was an right? excellent interview. But, but I mean, you carried it. I, mean, I was you just, I, it. I was just Omar the window carried dressing. It, he carried Omar, it. Look, you can't get that kind of interview without the interview. That's true. That's right. know, I can't do a good interview. <laughs> yeah. I'm terrible. I think you're great, but he I'm he terrible. did ask great questions. Omar asked unbelievable questions, yeah. and your answers were awesome. So look, yeah. if you guys ever get a chance to do an interview with that cat? You should do it's it. Hundred percent. Okay, he's, he's unbelievable. It's true. Hey Omar, what's up, brother? This is Joel Marion, Biotrust Nutrition, broke to 100 million, as you know, from the interview that we did together. Hey man, I just wanted to tell you thank you so much for all the advice that you gave me on starting my podcast, Born to Impact. It was uh, instrumental, very instrumental in me, skyrocketing right up the rankings and uh, actually hitting number one in the health category just last week. We are uh, releasing our 15th episode with Grant Cardone. Uh, this upcoming week grateful for your support for your love for your help I uh, appreciate all the equipment as well that you gave uh, uh, me on the audio equipment We've had so many people tell us that the sound is just amazing so crisp and the audio quality is awesome and That's one of the reasons why they love listening to the show is the quality of the audio And of course the guest and everything else uh, that you shared with me appreciate you brother and God bless you and talk to you soon all right, guys, so that's a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. A lot of people ask me questions all the time about my coaching program, so I figured what better way than to hop on here today, answer a couple of them for you. And if you guys have any more in the comments below, you can hit me up. You can shoot me a DM, email me, and you guys can also apply for that coaching program if you're ready to work one-on-one -on -one and take your personal brand, your impact, your podcast, your YouTube show to the next level so you can grow your business, grow your impact, and have a hell of a lot more fulfillment in the process going into 2020 and beyond. So again, guys, thank you so much for hopping on this video. Make sure to smash that subscribe button. Give this video a like. If it brought you tremendous value or somebody you know can benefit from it, do yourself a favor, give it a share, do them a favor. I think they'll thank you for it. Anyways, guys, as always, thank you for hopping on. As always, live strong, live with passion, and thank you for being one of the passionate few. If you guys enjoyed that video, be sure to hit that subscribe button right now because every week we bring you the very best in personal development content, interviews, and insights to help inspire you to take your life and your dreams and make them a reality. And also, if you wanna know how to book dream guests the same way I have, you can check the link below for my top three secrets. So if you have a podcast or a show or whatever it is and you wanna collaborate with them, if you click that link below, I'll give you those top three secrets to help you get in touch with anybody. And also, don't forget that The Passionate View is available on media platforms as well so you can subscribe to the podcast. And until next time, thank you for being one of the passionate few.